Hello and welcome back to the next episode of our Star Wars Jedi Survivor Let's Play series. In the last episode, we started off on our adventure up towards the observatory. We need to go up there and confront Dagon. We have made it about, I think, about halfway there. And now we need to continue on with our journey. Both. Mm. We're heading to the observatory. Already on my way. Okay, that's right. Bode's coming with us. I forgot about that. Probably nothing I can do with this. Oh, maybe I can. I don't know that this is where I wanted to go. But this is a shortcut. Okay. So I can use the lift now to get back down. Fair enough. I'll take it. It's honestly crazy how far this took us back down because we have really traveled quite the distance across this planet. This is a really huge, huge planet. I guess it makes sense because the Pylon Saloon is here and they expected it to be your home base. So they've really piled a lot of stuff into the area. Definitely gave it lots of levels to explore. And I, I like how, you know, with different levels, you need the different abilities to be able to come back. It does give you a lot of, um, I'll cover you from the sky. a lot of different ways to explore the area. But it also... It's modded. Probably for the high altitude. Oh. There we go. Okay. Ooh, am I going to need another one? Oh, no. It just... Okay. So, if you don't get it where you want it, you can shoot it out again. Got it. But it looks like... Oh, we might not make it. Looks like I need to make it into just a bit different of a position. So, maybe if we grab it from here and we put it out there can I still get it I think that's a bit closer to that ledge over there ah oh, no yeah there we go wow we just made that one holy crud that one was definitely all about the placement all right there's got to be something we can grab around here and yay there we go all right come on go right about I would say right about there that should get me closer to it than trying to jump out there on my own and then if we do that there we go whoa oh and now we get to fly i can see that the raiders are fighting the empire i mean i kind of like that idea i just didn't want them fighting me as well and it looks like those are probably where i'm going over there is where I'm going to say, yes, thank you for the lift. I appreciated it. And then we go over there. Holy crud. And there. Oh my goodness, that is a long way down. And we've got goo stuff. We're going to need some goo debobbler stuff to get through there. Uh, yeah. Can I get in that? I mean, that looks painful. I can. Okay. Hold on. We've got a lot of things in here. I can open that. That door is locked from the other side. We can do that. Hold on. What's this? No. Okay. Okay, so that's just a, a floaty thing. Once we get through. Oh, I see it. We need to do this. Nice work. Let's keep heading up. Oh, okay. There we go. So the other thing. Oh, I see. Now I can open it up. And we can do the goop. To get it no oh that's right I gotta switch to the goop <laughs> switch to our goop 
There we go. And make sure I switch it back before I do anything else. Are there any, like, pyrite shards hidden around in here? Doesn't look like it. And then if I bring this out, we can take it out here and put it where? If I put it there, that's back to where I just came from. Can I put this over here? I can. Will that get me in there? It will get me in here. Okay, you go shake them. We're gonna continue on up through the the thing, the Kobu dust. Why? It doesn't look like dust. I mean, dust doesn't doesn't form like that. At least I don't think so. Let's go ahead and unlock the observatory understructure. At least we're at the observatory. <laughs> That's a good thing. Wait a minute, I saw something. Did BD want to slice something? Oh no, it said climb. Okay, never mind. Oh, and then we are going over to there. Fun times. Fun times. You want me to go over there. Okay, well let's uh, drop in. I've been working on my dash skills. I can now do... Oh, I don't have any slow time ability. That's a sad... There you go, bud. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's not the way to go. Yeah, you guys come down to me. I don't want to make a wrong turn out there. Yeah, thank you. Keep going. Oh, no. So now we're fighting the Bedlam Raiders along with the Empire. This is fun. Yeah, calm your bobs, young man. Okay. Oh, you're not done. <laughs> well, sorry about that, buddy. I didn't want to leave you out. Okay, here we go. This is the better way to get up there than where I was trying to go. For sure. Oh, yay. Battle droids. Thank you. Oh, yep. Die. Mm -mm. There you go, buddy. There you go. There you go. Enjoy that. What are you doing up here? <laughs> and it looks like he could be a shortcut. Yeah. Dagon's nowhere to be seen. Well, we got a good idea where he's headed. Meet you at the top. Meet me at the top. Are you wanting to take me back? You are wanting to take me back. I don't think that's the way I want to go. Do I need to be down over there, I think? There we go. And if you can zip me over here. Thank you very much. That's a wall run up to these guys. <laughs> Why are we all so what? Was there a reason to come out here? Alright. Alright, let's go ahead and try that out. Go. There we go. And now we go over there uh cow there you go buddy you gotta hit it hard and then we just have to make our way around here watch the objects oh go up go up go up yeah oh i see it up there there we go oh good night there's a welcoming committee okay oh Okay, Bodhi. I don't suppose you'd like to come over here and say hello to me. Thank you. Thank you, Bodhi. I wasted my slow time, but it's all good. It'll build back up. Oh, I got another friend. And I lost another friend. Oh, my, they just going to keep uh, sending them to me. Well, I mean, if they just want to, I can practice my force pull. Gets me another skill point. I will take that. Thank you. Oh, I see. 
Uh, these are just the Roger Roger droids. I like the Roger Roger droids. They make me, they make me laugh. They're always getting into trouble. I don't like it when they, uh, they send me little fiery bobs, though. Come here. I saw you back there. <laughs> Trying to hide from me. <laughs> you gotta love it when they bob themselves, huh? Oh, that doesn't look like fun. Tell me that's not my way. I, I don't want to go that way. That doesn't look fun at all. That looks closed off. What do you want with the observatory? What? We're just following orders. <laughs> just a pawn? Do you carry a communication device? Yes. Activate it now. <laughs> My name is Dagon Gera. Your attack here has failed and your soldiers' lives are forfeit. Uh, I said what you asked, so let me go. All right. Dang. That was insane. He really has no empathy anymore, does he? I mean, like, he just doesn't, straight up doesn't care. Oh, good lord. Okay. That's how that goes. Whoa. Oh, okay. I get it. So, it yeets you out, and then it yeets you out again. Yeah. To where? Got it. Oh, good night. No. No, it's really, really not time to fight. Oh, don't fall off, Cal. Please don't fall off. Okay. I have two ways to go. This might just be a, a thing. Yeah, I thought so. Okay. Number one. Okay, so that... That's a jump bob thing, right? Yes. That's a jumpy thing. Out to there. I don't, I don't think I need that right now. What I think I need to do is go in here. Because we're going up. We're not going back out again, right? This feels like I'm getting closer to the right area. Oh, not these guys. I do not like these guys. No, 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 no. Ouch, no, dude. No, back him in the corner. Keep him in the corner. Cal, keep him in the corner. Okay. Okay. It's all good. It's all good. He is. He is not holding a dang thing back. What's that? Well, he's really fighting on two fronts right now, right? He's fighting his way to the observatory, but he's also trying to keep people behind to fight me and slow me down so that he gets there first. And, you know, typical game fashion, he's going to get there first. Or about the same time, just right before, right? So, it's going to be uh, interesting, this fight we were going to have with him whenever we, uh, whenever we get to it. Once I figure out where it's at. <laughs> because I tell you, I spill 90% of this game lost. We need to get out there somehow. Can I charge that? BD is that? There we go. Oh, cool. Oh, never mind. I see. There we go. There we go. This is. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. Mm-hmm. There it is, right there. Come on, Cal. Go, go, Cal. Go, 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 go. No, no. Go, Cal. Go, go, go. There you go, buddy. Had to sort a few bedlam flies to make a landing. No problem. 
That was crazy. You just, you had to figure out the pattern of the broken pieces versus anything else. It wasn't so much walking around it. underestimated the Bedlam Raiders. Dagon may be delusional, but he's got an army that believes in him. They think he's taking them to Tantalor. Over my dead body. Uh, he's not gonna take anybody. He would, he would have betrayed them all. It, there was no, there was never any doubt about that. He was gonna betray everybody. Just for his own good. Just like he, he betrayed his friend. When he, um, right? Looks like I need to go up there. That looks like my area of where I need to go. But yeah, he, he betrayed her. There was no doubt in my mind that he would have. Well, goes up. Yeah, goes apparently Cal goes down. <laughs> All right, I saw a Bob thing up there. Hold on. Yeah. Oh, can you do the R1 before I get up there? Because that would be amazing if you could. No, don't do it, Beatty. Maybe we need to just line that up just a tad bit better. So maybe if I put it, like, right there without falling down the hall. Oh, it stayed. Cool. So if I do it there... Ah, no, that does not get me high enough. Okay. That's not the way I'm going, then. I just broke that thing off. Like, can I... Aim it up there? Was I not aiming high enough? That's what it was. Incredible. There we go. Incredible. So not only do you need to aim it down, you need to aim it up. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. I'll take that one, game. We caught one as he tried to escape. Please, I surrender. This is the army that ended the mighty Jedi Order. Kill him. They ended the Jedi Order through subterfuge and vast ma amounts of enemy or uh, of troopers. You know, my daughter right? I mean, in yeah. a way. Her favorite is this black market scanner I took off a hut enforcer. There was a lot more a going on. There was betrayal from within, but life. you're right. All of this. All For this. Yep. All of it. <sighs> I don't know. I I'm not, like, all the way totally up on all the, the Star Wars lore. I like watching the Star Wars. Um, well, I like watching the Star Wars movies and stuff. I haven't watched any of the, the shows, but Where are all the Raiders? I do enjoy it when I watch it. Yeah, slacker's more up on all that than what I am, but I, I like the world and I, I like, you know, what I've seen of it. I just didn't get into, like, the lore and stuff. Maybe that's a bad thing. Maybe it's a good thing. Actually, you know what? No, I'm going to nap again because I want to save. Dang it. And now, yeah, <laughs> it's not really a nap nap. And I'm probably putting my big my mouth in my foot or my foot in my mouth you sure kind of thing. Do we have a choice? All right, let's do this. With it all, but, you know, I, I, this is a, a layman's enjoyment of Star Wars. One we'll put you? it that way. <laughs> I'll put it that way. That's a kinder way of saying I'm totally ignorant of it, right? I mean, not totally ignorant, just not as knowledgeable as most people are on it. And I'm not afraid to admit it. And it certainly doesn't decrease or increase my enjoyment of the game, I don't believe. Eliminated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you look like that Q-Tip General. I forget his name. From the Clone Wars. <laughs> That's what I always called me. I always like he was fighting with Q-Tips. Yeah, scan, BD. What's that? Good job, BD. A minor Oculus. Okay, it looks like that's the way I came. Oh, good night. You want me to tell me you don't want me to go out there ah there we go that's better than trying to jump out a door oh 
Okay, maybe not. Maybe that was not the way to go. I mean, it is the way to go, but... Uh, no. No. Please. There we go. No. Okay, yeah. No, no, no. Bad dude. Is that all of them? Hmm. Oh, there we go. You had to do it twice. I get it. Oh, no, not these big boys. I do not like the big boys. Get him in a corner, cow. Thank you. Ah, no, no. Foes, stick him in the back. Come on. Oh, man, dude. Thank you. Thank you. Jeez. Was it that hard, sir? <laughs> Seriously. Good night. Whoa! How did you survive that? There we go. What? What do you mean, round three? What do you think you're doing with that thing? Oh. Wait until you see what I can do with that thing. It's magical. <laughs> it's magical. Um... That doesn't look safe. Yeah, no, I don't want to go out there. That's stupid. That looks like death and dismemberment. There's... There's got to be a different area it wants me to put it, right? Hold on. Nope. Do it again, BD. Does that close me off? No. Ah, oh, got it. There we go. It's all on how many times you do the thing. I understand. So, are we going to just bypass everything and go straight over to there? Because that sounds good to me. Yeah, that sounds good to me. <laughs> yeah, there we go. I'll take it. To our... Well, no. No. Oh, can I just go up? No. No, we can't just go up. We're going into a wall run again. The big wall run thingies of doom and death and let's not die -ness. Thank you. Okay. Made it up here. Is there a shortcut I can unlock back down to there? That would be very nice. Ooh, I can do that. This opens up. A shortcut. I like that. Is that going to open? No. I can hear somebody talking. I think it's just a, somebody around that we're not going to see. It looks like what I need to do is go up this way. But always unlock your shortcuts before you do anything, ahead. just in case you fall off the world. Droids. You know, that would suck if you had to climb it all again. Oh, hi guys. Oh, I like the Roger Roger. <laughs> I like fighting the, the 150. That was so much fun. Like, so much fun. Don't fall off, cow. Nah. Nah, these guys. Hold on. Keep... I know, I'm doing fine. These are the ones that give me a little bit of trouble. The blaster ones. There you go. Very cool, Cal. Very nice finishing move. I approve. Ten out of ten would have, would finishing move again. How about you, BD? Here we go. Oh my gosh. Are we at the top? I think we're there at the top. Okay. I will not return. Seek me out. Or go to Tanalor. That is yours to decide. May the got the message a few years too late. <laughs> If Santari had only stood with me, we could have convinced the Council that Tanelor was worth the sacrifice. Now she's gone. 
Ravis is gone. The Order is gone, and I am free! You're not free, Dagon. You're alone. Why are you here when your true enemy is out there? How could you let the galaxy fall to this unworthy machine of an empire? You think yourself a survivor, but you are a failure! They haven't beaten us. Not yet. Now who is blinded by the past? Within the Abyss, the Empire cannot reach us. I will forge these raiders into an elite army led by disciples trained in the Force at my temple. Then, when the time is right, I will strike out and cleanse this galaxy with fire. <laughs> We've already got an Emperor. Give us the compass. And why would I do that? Because I'm a father who's running out of options. And you're standing in the way of a better life for my little girl. You hand it over, or I will put you down. What small dreams you cling to. Enough! Tanlor beckons. Wow, okay, it looks like we are doing this now, and Bodhi is not happy about it. I mean, I don't blame him. I can see he really wants to keep his daughter alive, and, and I would probably do everything I could in my power to make sure that my children were fine and safe and happy and everything. But good lord, dude. There we go. You're still chained by the past. You are blinded, sir. You're so blind. If we are you are jaded. Are you gonna kill Bode? Ah, oh, man, dude. Ah, uh, no. Come on, dude. I could annihilate you. Galaxy would never know this. No, dude. It did not have to come to this. Dude. You will not stop me. I was gonna say, please do not make me have to not finish fighting him this time because that would really suck. Block. Yeah, I found the right one, dude. Ah, son of a gun. I did what the order was too weak to do. No, you didn't. That she betrayed me. No, you were, you did everything wrong, dude. You, your soul is dark. Killing cow, for the love of God. How does it feel to know that you're about to die? That your life meant nothing? <laughs> Don't resist. You can't hide from me. Ah, oh, yes. I feel it. Loss. Suffering. Shame. Anger. 
There's immense power in such emotions, but you were too weak. And now it's too late. I think actually it takes a stronger person to resist the pull of the force. I think he was the one that was weak. I will not return. You're lost. You've strayed from the path. And you are no Jedi. kind of force hallucination fueled by fear I use his against him not so scary now still in one piece BD? Give me some good news. Maybe Dagon was right. <laughs> you sure you're not still, uh, you know? <clears throat> Think about it. Tantalor's a fortress. We should use it for the hidden path. Gather allies, train. They'd never see us coming. I don't know, that seems risky. Everything is at risk, so long as the Empire is around. Besides, you don't want Katha spending her whole life in hiding, do you? If she's safe, Cal? Yeah. Yeah, I'll take that. Yeah. Yeah, okay, I understand that. But someday, someone's gonna have to face the Empire. Why not us? Beck Cordova can fix this up. Let's head back to Jeddah. Sure. I'm gonna take a look around first. See if I can find a manual for that thing or something. We'll figure it out. Yeah. Mm-mm. I think we just had problems with Empire. Bodhi right there. You saved my neck. He doesn't want to fight Again. the Empire, does he? Thanks. Oh, no. Cal, don't let him. Don't let Bodhi become your, uh, your Dagon. Okay. Wow. We have the, uh, we've got it, but at what cost? Because I got a feeling Bodhi may end up being my Dagon. You got anything to say? You go ahead, Cal. I'm sure the crew can't wait to hear the news. Meet you right. Back at the Mantis. Right. Yeah, I don't, I don't feel good about him staying here. I think he's going to find something that, uh, uh, I think he's gonna betray me. I, I've said it since the beginning. I think he's gonna betray me and I got even stronger feelings about it now And again, I have no no clue. I have seen nothing on this game I have kept myself totally blind because I didn't want any spoilers so. All right, well, I could use a save point for sure after that battle good gravy That guy I'm I'm very sorry and relieved that he's gone because I did enjoy our, our confrontations, but uh, yeah, 
It's like, who's my bad guy now? Besides the Empire. Well, that also looks like it's going to be a really long journey back. So, I think what I'm going to do for now is go ahead and leave it here for the day. In the next episode, we will continue making our way back to the Pylon Saloon so that we can head back over to Jeddah, turn in this compass, and see what it has in store for us and where we are going to be heading in the future. So for now, thank you all so very much for joining me today. I've been Vault Girl. I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I hope I'll see you in the next one.